Hi folks and welcome to Hex Token Channel. Oh man, oh man, so much happening. Richard Hart live stream at the moment and a premiere and of course uh, Daytona 500. So we're going to get into a bit of that now. Let us go folks, Hex.com. Uh, let's go. And of course it's day 794, 3rd of February 2022. We've got a price of 18.6 cents and uh, that's up 3%. So we'll take that. Very, very cool. Uh, so we've got increases 5 of the last 10 days. Not too bad. Let's have a look at the return on investment multiplier. From the all-time low, the 5th of January 2020, that's 3,298x. Nice payout for T-share is 6, of course, and that looks really good. T-share uh, price is now 3,855, just up slightly from yesterday. And the T-share rate is up 5.8, and then we're now at 20,704.5. Wow, that's fantastic. And onwards and upwards for that. The average stake length, 6.1 years, just up slightly from yesterday. Annual percentage yield rate, uh, interest in early end, end uh, stake penalties, 38.28%. Uh, really good to earn a, a return like this during high inflation period. Uh, liquidity pool, 149.2 million uh, is in the pool. Uh, that's a bit of a jump there. So obviously people have added to the pool. And uh, the USDC has also uh, gone up to 20 million. So nice. Liquidity in the pool, 1,537. And of course, let's have a look at the valuations, 11.32 billion and uh, the market cap 107.52 billion. That includes the origin accounts and of course the T-share market cap 40.88 billion up from yesterday. Nice to see it back over 40 and the T-shares, wow, back over 10 million 600,000. We're up 13,595. Nice to see uh, these really cool staking at the moment. Very, very cool. Let's go over the total supply, 638. Uh, 3 billion and that's up 15.2 million on the minted inflation this is actually what actually hits the market uh, out of the inflation circulating supply 577.5 billion that is up 36.7 million uh, today and the change in staking uh, 60.8 billion and that is down 29 21 and a half million let's have a look at the uh, staked uh, percentage that is 9.53 percent of uh, liquid hex is staked, and of course, uh, of total hex is staked, I should say, and payout uh, 63.7 million. This is all deferred inflation into the future, only comes out when staking matures. Uh, penalties 291,000 today, so relatively modest compared to some of the epic days we've had in the last 10 days. Total holders 417,000, up 333. Stakers up 129 uh, to 77,848, and of course, a total stakers up 153 to 98,914. And current holders 175 uh, up to 279.884. So those are the results for day 794, folks. Let's get into the real price at the moment. We can see the market price is at 18.6 cents. And we traded in the last day candle between 18.4 and 19.15. Uh, so here we are, folks, waiting for this little breakout for sure. Looks like we're going to break out of the descending triangle. Uh, so this is bullish. This is bullish. Uh, very, very cool. Let's have a look at the... Uh, uh, we're still waiting for the DMI to play out, so we haven't seen much happening with that yet. So we'll wait for that to happen too. And uh, yeah, definitely looking better. And of course, how many days until the Pulse Exact Post finishes? Let's put the old timeline in. And so 20 days, 20, 20 days, including today, is 21. So uh, still going there, folks. Getting down there, three weeks to go till the end of Pulse X, So uh, nice. Let's jump over to the T-share. It's uh, 3,857 at the moment. And we can sort of see that this leveling off as we wait, waiting for that next run. Uh, and, of course, adoption is going to blow up uh, particularly well when Pulse Chain watches. Uh, the share rate is up and to the right. Man, oh, man, heading towards 21,000. Pretty, pretty cool. It means get your shares, to get your stakes today uh, because the T-share rate is going up over time. The hit payout of Hex per T-share is awesome. Of course, over six most of the time with a little bit of penalties. I think it's at about 5.984 uh, without any penalties, so very nice. And uh, here we are, the 15-year global stakes. We're going to zoom in on the next six months. Uh, this is everybody's stakes, so we're going to have a look and see what's going on there. Uh, so, yeah, we've got a candle coming up on the 5th here, uh, 266 million hex. Other than that, a fairly soft point of view, and I think that they uh, really have leveled off uh, a lot of so we've got a good room for uh, maybe less selling now and the time for a price to start moving up so any time in here looks pretty good we have got this candles here uh, around here that we're waiting for at the end of february early march and of course that's all around the end of the pulse sacrifice interestingly enough uh, and also uh, we're going to see how that plays out 
Then, of course, a big gap up until May, and we're expecting Pulse Chain to launch somewhere in here as we were in uh, March, April. So let's jump over to Hexwell. Uh, we had a couple of big uh, stakes mature up 45 days, 50 days, 20 million, 20 million. Uh, so there we are. Let's jump over to Pulse Chain. Uh, Pulse Chain, of course, going to be the biggest airdrop in history, biggest yield farming in history. Uh, super fast, super cheap, and of course, uh, the fastest way to mass adoption. And uh, it's going to be mind blowing. Looking forward to it. Uh, the dev, of course, uh, two hours ago had a little update here in the Pulse Chain testnet. Uh, apart from that, nothing else there. And of course, the blocks, let's do a refresh because this number keeps changing. Uh, so it's up to 64 million transactions. So it was only 1.4 million two days ago. Uh, it's hard to say what's going on there because I don't often see a lot of transactions in the blocks. Uh, but it's, this is what it's saying. It's 64 million there. So interesting stuff there. Uh, people have speculated, is it the Amen bot testing, stuff like that? Uh, so uh, something that is of interest. All right, so let's have a look at the sacrifice. We're going to refresh this too. On PulseX, let's go. Um, we've got uh, 961.5 million uh, sacrificed on the ETH chain. We've just ticked over a new day, so we've got 23 hours and 34 minutes to go into a 5% rise. Uh, the current price for 10,000 points is $3.56. So uh, in terms of the price of PulseX, that would be 0 0.00356, uh, and that's what you're paying today. Uh, we can see we're slowly creeping up here, but still on the lower side, but not far away from the middle, uh, at around about $5 up here. So pretty, pretty interesting uh, as we climb through. So I think we're on day, just, just ticked over into day 37, and we are of day 59. Uh, so ticking away there, folks. Let's jump over to the Pulse X tap. If you follow this, this is where to do the sacrifices. Follow the instructions. You'll be perfectly fine. Uh, most people are sacrificing to this ETH address if they're on these ETH or compatible chains. And of course, using common tokens is the is the pretty much the safest way of doing that. Uh, obviously, hex is about fifty five percent of is sacrificed with hex. If you're going to use the other chains, just follow the steps one to three. You can use Bitcoin, Bitcoin Cash, etc. Um, so just follow the instructions; you'll be good. You can always do a small amount and then do a big amount if you want to be comfortable. Let's jump over to the uh, pulsexleads.com third party site. Uh, and a big shout out to Game Systems Ten, the developer at the bottom there. You can always do a donation at the top right there. The total balance at the moment, this includes uh, Pulse Chain, uh, sorry, this includes uh, Ethereum, Binance Smart Chain, and Polygon Matic is $1,012,236,098. But uh, total, uh, we're probably over $1,040,000, uh, including uh, other altcoins and chains and stuff. The estimated uh, sacrifice points, $17.1145 uh, uh, um, trillion. Uh, Pulse X points are very, very cool. Uh, we've still got seven wallets over 10 million. We've got the total wallets have jumped quite strongly from yesterday. Uh, we're at 127,853 on these chains. Very, very cool. Uh, my favorite number, of course, is the hex sacrifice. 555 uh, million has been sacrificed. That's pretty cool. 5555. So we'll get a 5555 soon. And of course, that's 2 billion, 171 million hex off the market uh, on ETH chain and on Pulse, Pulse chain when it launches. Very exciting to see that. So very nice. Let's see if we, we've got the day results for the closing day, the day 37. Yep, we had 1.267 million uh, yesterday. And of course, we're on day 38 now. So uh, nice. $2,000 so far. I think that's what I said on there yesterday. Yes, so day 37 is finished. And of course, that ended us up at 1 billion, 12 million, 237,000. And of course, day 38 is open. Uh, and of course, uh, we're at $2,000. So we've got a long way to go for that. All right, very, very cool. Let's uh, look at the highlights, of course. Uh, here we've got the um, the, NAS, the NASCAR, uh, sorry, the Daytona uh, 500 car. Uh, this is the pictures at the moment. Look at that, beautiful. Uh, I think this is, looks really good. It's going to stand out really, really good. Now um, we're going to just scroll down a little bit here. We can see uh, that it was pretty amazing, $640,000 raised. And uh, here's what the driver said, JJ comments. My entire life has been built around racing. I graduated high school a year earlier just to get out of the, out and race. When asked what drives him, JJ replied, it's the competition. That's what I do. This is what I love. So nice on that one. Uh, we also had Motley Investor here. I love all the donations and OGs who bought our big money, but honestly, it was the small guys who really tugged my heartstrings, telling me they are brand new but really want to contribute 100 to $200 to have a brand new community members give up opportunity costs to buy hex, participate where they can. I don't think you'll find this anywhere else. So that was pretty cool. Uh, and uh, finally, we got uh, last week's interview. You've got the best community in crypto behind you. Best of luck. And of course, JJ replied, I'm definitely excited about it. I've been a few years since they've sold out this early. Everyone is so stoked and excited about the Daytona and checking out the new car. 
and seeing really what's going on. And so that's pretty exciting. We can see some of the cool uh, colors of the car here. And of course, the outfit that the driver, JJ, will be wearing looks amazing. This is really going to stand out really, really good with the black backdrop on it too. I think that adds a lot to it. It's really going to pop. It's not too, too busy. Uh, just perfectly uh, colored in my view. So hats off to the team. Uh, Agape said, a friend of mine called me this week and asked if I knew a company who would sponsor a NASCAR team. I told her I didn't know a company, but I knew a community. So big shout out to the Hex community, uh, Pulse Chain and Pulse X can community, awesome stuff. This is just the beginning. And of course, a lot of marketing is going around this. And there'll be at least uh, three camera crews there as well. And a good chance highest of stakes will be included in that. Uh, very nice. Hope you enjoyed that one. Feel free to subscribe, like, share, hit the bell. Join me later on in a couple of hours time for the Pulse X live show. It's going to be super, super good. Uh, but once again, uh, Richard Hart's uh, premiere is on at the moment. So go check that out. Uh, it'll be a lot of fun. All right. Bye for now.